No, The Irishman is not the equivalent of Marvel's Captain America. It's a movie about loyalty and treachery between friends in the Mafia. So what kind of VFX is that film going to have, I hear you ask? Good question. The story, The Irishman, jumps back and forth through several generations showing the three leading actors in their youth Middle age and old age. The challenge was how to film the actors and make them look younger. The technology didn't exist, so Industrial Light and Magic created it. Wearing facial masks was not an option because with so few markers, they would lack the detail necessary. So they decided to use pixels. They created a three camera rig. The center camera is the director's camera. The ones either side were infrared cameras called witness cameras. The software they created, Flux, takes the information from the three cameras and triangulates it, creating a 3D geometry where every pixel is mapped. Now, instead of 200 markers, you have thousands constantly moving. With this many markers, you can start to see that the face doesn't just move when a person talks. It vibrates every pixel affecting another. Understanding this allows them to to alter the darkness or depth of the pixels that form, say, a wrinkle, without altering the way they move when, for example, they smile. This new technology is so realistic and subtle that most people who watch the film never even questioned how it was done. And although still in its early stages, it opens the door to a world of VFX without grey suits and green screens. a like if you enjoyed this video don't forget the links to the music used in this video are in the video description and be sure to let us know in the comments which movie vfx you'd like to see behind next